now this patient is 60 years old and he has uh, crush injury in his right hand and followed by this he developed pseudex dystrophy and a painful edema on the right hand so we are planning to give cervicothoracic sympathetic block to minimize the problem and discomfort by blocking the cervicothoracic sympathetic trunk so we have marked here this is the most prominent spine is c7 cervical spine and next prominent spine is t1 and just below there is another spinous process that is t2 the landmark is a point is taken between the t1 and t2 spinous process and a line is drawn laterally from the midpoint and the distance is about three and a half to four centimeter so a point at this level is taken and we have encircled this point by red circle so this is the point of entry for cervicothoracic sympathetic block on the right side now i have taken 18 ml of the solution this contains 8 ml sensor cane and 10 ml distal water and i have taken a needle from 20 gauge intracat the length of this needle is about 6 cm now insert the needle perpendicularly that the x will agree perpendicularly in all directions and see let us see whether this strikes the bone or not insert the needle little quarterly Now this is tried at this distance. Inject little amount of the solution. This about at a three and a half centimeter. And from this point, now this is strike the transfer source. Withdraw the needle towards the skin, skin, and then redirect quarterly. See, it's redirected quarterly. Now again, strike the bone. Further withdraw. The needle and then further now it is going through now now at this level always aspirate and try to inject and you will have a give point feeling further at once now there is no resistance here and see always inject after aspiration if there is cuffing it means you have touched the pleural membrane now needle is fine so it takes time always aspirate and keep watch on the monitor to look is there any bradycardia or a change sudden change in the pulse So after injection of few ml, we draw the needle and then aspirate in different plane. See, this is no blood. Aspirate and then inject. Is easy going because the needle is fine. This is about 22 gauge needle. Now the block is nearly complete. So we have injected 18 ml of the solution. Now see there is cuffing, withdraw the needle, if there is cuffing, remove it.